this is taking so long. Mom, what's wrong? I'm sorry, sweetie. Go back to sleep. I'm no, really everything's. I just didn't. I thought he'd be out of surgery by now. What, you think something went wrong? No, 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 of course not. God, I hope not. Mom, you're worried. Yeah. It's okay. Oh. Uh, uh, how is Bo? I mean, did, did he make it out of surgery? Bo did make it through the surgery. Oh, my God. And we were able to remove the bullet. So my dad's gonna be okay? Well, we hope so. Uh, but it's been a long night and he's lost a lot of blood. Uh, if he makes it through the next few hours... If? Well, we're doing everything that we can to get him awake and breathing on his own. Okay, well, then what do you, what, what do you need us to do? What, you just tell me and we'll I, do it. I wish it were that simple. But there are some things that Bo is gonna have to do on his own. Natalie, how the hell did this happen? Apparently, Skyler was aiming for Rex, and then Uncle Bo decided he'd take the bullet instead. Sounds like Bo, doesn't it? Yeah. Damn fool. Thank you for coming to get me. Of course. Jessica and I, we, we tried to call you several times, but you never picked up. Yeah, sorry. I turned my phone off last night. What happened? You may as well be the first to know. Kim and I split up. Hey, Rex. How's Bo doing? Uh, he made it through surgery, but Dr. Evans says it's still touch and go. If he can make it through the next couple hours, he has a chance. He's really weak. All because he got between me and Skylar's gun. God help him for that. I'm sorry. No. Skylar's the one that should be sorry. Listen, um... The news just keeps on getting worse and worse. Why? Did something else happen? More like proof of the bad news that we already got. I did the DNA thing in case there was a screw up. Allison was right. I'm not your mom. So I'm just some random kid she found at the hospital. Substitute for the son you had with Mitch. The one that died. About that. Could we not go into that now? What are you talking about? Could we just wait till Bo is out of the woods? Roxy, what's going on? Are you saying that your baby didn't die after all? Should sure don't look that way. Do you know who he is? Listen, seriously, can we not go into that right now? What? No, hey, how many secrets have we had? Where did it get us? Roxy, if you know who your son is, you need to say so. Skylar. Skylar? Skyler? Yeah, go figure. He's so pale. Isn't there anything that you can give him, like oxygen or... or... We're giving him all the support we can, Nora. The rest is up to him. Lawrence being my father, he's Skyler's. Yeah, well, I couldn't believe it either. That's why I did the DNA thing. But it's true. I don't understand. How did this happen again? After I had my baby, we realized how bad off it was, and we knew that we had to do something. So Allison took me to this hospital, where her sister was a doctor, Leah Joplin. Leah Joplin? Yeah, then Allison panicked. She thought my baby was gonna die, so she grabbed you from one of the nurses and she gave you to me. And she told me that you were mine. And then when she found out that my real kid was gonna live, it was too late to make the switch. Mitch would have been suspicious. Yeah. So Allison made sure that I kept you and that her sister kept the other kid. She gave away your baby and never told you. 
Listen, um, I gotta go because Skyler's arraignment is in. Oh, you're going to court? Yeah, well, someone's gotta stand by him. Why shouldn't it be his mother? I know that you were probably expecting something like this, but there's one thing that may surprise you. About Kim? Yeah. Uh, I didn't catch her at anything, and she came clean all by herself. And I don't think Kim would admit to cheating on me if she were only after my money. I guess that's something, Dad. Look, if I, if I was hard on Kim, I'm sorry. It was only because I didn't want to see you get hurt. Well, the hell with me. I can take whatever I have to. So long as, at the end of the day, I still have my brother. Remember when I found out I couldn't walk? I really lost it. Threw stuff. Yelled. But you let me. You knew what I needed more than I did. I never thanked you. Instead, I made you the bad guy. I blamed you and Mom for not letting me have that surgery. I need to make that up to you, Dad. I really need to. Just please. Just please give me that chance. How are you holding up? Fine. You're a bad liar. Just like your father. It's good to see you, Uncle Clint. My dad will like to hear your voice. Even if you're still mad at him. Oh, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking it wasn't all that long ago that I was threatening to shoot you myself. I could tell you the reason I didn't was because Paul would never have forgiven me, but we both know that's not it. You're my brother. And truth be told, I can't imagine a world without you in it. When does Skylar Joplin deserve any support from you? He kidnapped Gigi. He was ready to shoot me in cold blood. Listen, I know that Skylar did some very, very bad things. I really? know that. There's a guy in the next room that might die because of what Skylar did. He might die, Roxy. Rex, nobody hated Skylar Joplin on this whole planet more than I did. I wanted to wring his neck. So what's changed? One DNA test and suddenly the guy's got a clean slate? You know, it's really not about him. It's about me. What do you mean? You know, when you find out something like this, you really start thinking about what it's like to be somebody's mother. And I know I never figured it out with you. I mean, I was bad to you and Natalie. I know that. I loved you, but I blew it big time. And Rex, I got a chance for duo. I'm all that Sky has left. And if I got a chance to do something better for him than I ever did for you, I'm taking it. <laughs>